Hi, this is Press of Atlantic City Sports Editor Mark Melhorn, and I'm here with our high school football writer Mike McGarry to preview the Bridgeton High School Bulldogs. Uh, interesting year for the for Bridgeton. Uh, usually a smaller school. They are a smaller school. They are going to be in Group Three this year. They have had a history of success. Uh, they were six and four last season, but uh, they're really going to be rebuilding this year, Mike. Yeah, in many ways, and this is the theme of the article that I wrote for the uh, preview story, which comes out the uh, day before the season starts uh, next Thursday. They're kind of starting over this year. Uh, from a perspective, they graduated 21 seniors off last season's team. Uh, that's a lot to lose for a Group 4 school. That's a lot to lose for a, uh, a group, uh, I believe they're Group 3, three. right now, right. Uh, like Bridgeton. Uh, more importantly, uh, their field has been completely redone. Their stadium has been renovated. Always one of the neat places to see a game. Uh, it was one of the uh, FDR public works projects back in the 1930s. Uh, it's been renovated. They've got new aluminum bleachers. They've got a brand new artificial grass field. It is a beautiful facility. Not only have they renovated, but they kept the character of the old place. They've got those archways. Anybody who's been to Bridge and you pull up on that street there, they've got the archways when you walk in. So it's retained the character of the old stadium, but it's completely new. And it's one of the best facilities in the Cape of Langley. So they've got a new field, and they're kind of starting over with a lot of sophomores. Right. Uh, you know, you mentioned a lot of 21 seniors from last last season graduating, um, lots of sophomores. Who are some of the skill positions uh, that we should look for, though, for the Bulldogs? Well, I think Stefan Bowman, uh, running back, established himself as, uh, you know, had an outstanding freshman year. He rushed 132 times for 722 yards. You would expect to him to build on that after uh, last year. Capadonna Miller, great first name, five foot seven, hundred forty five pound wide receiver and defensive back is another guy who uh saw time as a freshman last year. Both those guys are gonna play defense, they're gonna play cornerbacks. Coach Dave Ellen said uh he knows they're gonna be tested, but you know, they want that. They wanna be tested, they want the ball on offense, so that that's good to see. And then they've got uh junior Ronald Williams taking over at quarterback. He's been the backup the last two seasons, but he knows the offense, so he's gonna go in there and look to provide some stability in leadership for the Bulldogs. 